Yeah. These niggas tap on the internet. Yeah. No, we not ending that. No, we, not uh. that. no, we ain't feeling that. Back on they butt, trying to not niggas selling back. Uh. We in the camp back. No, we ain't sitting back. Hey guys, we got a new episode of Talk of the Town today. We got a special guest. Double O. I'm a double O, swear. Right. So, how, tell us what's, why why that name? Howie Double O? Well, yeah. for me, my nickname in the, in the hood is Howie. And then Double O. I mean, that just came from some other shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Top door. So, um, where you from? Co op City, Side 2. So, the Bronx. Yeah, the Bronx. Okay. And how is it growing up in the Bronx? I mean, it's cool. It's rough, but you feel me? Can't do it. Um, any other artists upcoming in the Bronx that y'all hang uh, with? Uh, that's upcoming. Other than yeah. my guys, Scotty yeah. Dripping, EJ Banks, Bill Monty, Sunny Rose, you know, the rest of the members. That's it. Nobody else. So there's not a lot of artists out there. It's a lot, but I don't, I don't really fuck with niggas. So. Not like that, but I'm just saying. Like, so what makes you and and your guys stand out from all the other artists? I feel like we different. We got. We got different flows. I feel like right now in the Bronx, everybody trying to be on this drill, aggressive, you know what I'm saying? Like we do all that drill, melodic, everything. R and B, got singers in my hood and all that. Okay. Uh, so when did you start taking music seriously? Um seriously, yeah. I started taking rap seriously like last year. But I've been doing music. Been doing music, but seriously though, like last year, in fact. So last year, so um, what made you like want to go strong with the music scene? Cause I just seen like I seen people from my hood making it, like from the same people that I was around making it. So I'm like, I mean, I could do the same thing. Like I see my boy Capella just got from me, he got lit. Yeah. I been gang from me, so like, uh, it's my peers that's motivating me to do this. So, uh, okay. Okay. So how would you describe your sound? I feel like I'm different. Like I got, I do the drill, mm -hmm. then I could switch it up. Like I get, I get into the auto tune vibe. I just made like an R&B type song not too long mm -hmm. ago. That soon come out. Okay. For me, I feel like yeah, I switch it up. I don't, I don't keep the same. I was gonna say, so you don't consider yourself a drill artist? Nah, nah, definitely not. Okay, so you just an artist period, or yeah. you try to stick to one lane, or? Nah, I'm an artist period. I feel like I do everything. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so Daddy and Cali challenge. Yeah. Really. <laughs> what what inspired that challenge? Uh, feel me? Well, like a year ago today, I was in Cali. Okay. Movie, like unforgettable trip, man. Like, that's what really inspired this whole song too. Like, feel me? Met a little Daddy and Cali. She had the fatty. You know the rest, feel what I'm saying? <laughs> but yeah. And this is just a song that people could dance to, people could vibe to, feel me? So like, uh, Okay, so with that challenge, everybody was doing a challenger and stuff. Do you feel like um, we need challenges to make songs pop or it helps, or what do you think? I feel like we don't need them, but I feel like they do help a lot. Because most of the songs that's lit right now, so for challenges on TikTok, Triller and all that, feel me? So, I felt like Batty and Cali was just one of them songs that, like, if it hit TikTok and go viral on TikTok, should it be a movie? Well, okay, so, but um, do you like that that's the thing now, to do challenges and TikToks and dancing? Nah, yeah, yeah. That, me, that makes make, your job easier? It do make the job artist. easier. It do make the job easier, but it, it just gives more people, like, a vibe, because now you see one person do it, you might, like, oh, yeah, this shit crazy. Let me let me try this too. Mm -hmm. I mean, feel me? Make it like go crazy. So, um, what's what's your favorite song that you created that's out that we know? Um, Batty and Cali, Two Tone. That's off my last tape. Uh, mm -hmm. Astronaut Kid. Um, yeah, Batty and Cali and Two Tone. Or uh, and Trips. I just dropped that. Uh, yeah, Trips is out now. Yeah. So explain the um Lazy P, the Chosen Astronaut. Chosen astronaut. Well, <laughs> feel me? why that? I say that because like everybody in my hood right now, like they say like yo, if it's anybody that's gonna make it, like they they believe in me. So I feel like, and we the astronauts. Feel me? The bees and the astronaut. So like why I feel like I'm the chosen astronaut. Feel me? Cause we, 
Yeah, we billionaires, man. You see it on the pants. We, we the big billionaires. That's all I wear. BBC. They gotta sign me. I ain't gonna lie. I need okay. a deal. Respect me. Yeah, I'm saying. Brandon. But yeah. All right, so the astronauts. Okay, okay, okay. Billionaires. Billionaire gang. So, y'all feel like y'all the chosen one? Yeah. Funny. Okay. And um, the song Trips, how did that come about? We was traveling a lot. <laughs> yeah, like around last year to now, like we've been making you feel me, a lot of moves. So like, we just be in the stool really. Like we don't, like, we just come up with this shit while we in the stool. We find the beat and then like, we get high and then whatever, you feel me, start freestyling and then we just come up with this shit. So you freestyle, you don't write? I write, but as of lately, like I haven't been writing that much. Like I just be in the stool, high. <laughs> okay, so the song trips. You dropped that on your own YouTube channel. You didn't do like the raps and hustles, the flow tactics. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why is that? Cause like, for me, cause if the song blow, I want people to just come back to my YouTube channel for more. Like, I do plan on using one of those pages in the future, but I feel like everybody doing it, and I want to just, I want to see where my fan base at really. For me, so yeah. Okay. Do you have any upcoming features on the way? Um, like major features or no, some regular? Your yeah, I got some, some shit with Scotty Dripping coming up. That's Scotty Drip right there. Yeah. Feel me? Um, I got more. I got a collab tape coming with EJ Banks, and he about to drop his shit. EJ versus Youngin. Um, okay. And then I got my whole like, cause we got we branding a little label now. So my whole me and my guys, we about to do a group tape coming soon. Uh -huh. Facts. Yeah, that's the only feature. Right so you doing music? With most of your friends. Yeah, I don't really. I, I do outside features, and I got like one little major feature with Lil Quill, but other than that, I don't really. Uh, I'm gonna say any artist that you want to collab with that you feel like is working in New York. Uh, in New York. Mm, mm, Tri-state nah. area. <laughs> I don't feel me. I be. I don't really listen to niggas. I don't really feel me, but. Uh. Yeah, I don't know. Nobody right now. Okay, okay, okay. How do you feel about the um, New York music scene? I feel like it's lady right now. Everybody doing anything for me. I should live. I need to get in there and get active with everybody. What you going to do differently from what you've seen so far? Mm, I'm trying to, like, I'm trying to be that one nigga that, like, they be like, it's not straight drill. Like, because the Bronx, like I said, everybody coming up with this drill shit. Trying to be a little different, like, okay, oh, he's one of those. Like Lil TJ, like he he did a he did like the auto tune vibe. Auto tune, then he switched it up. And then for me, yeah, that's what I'm that's what I'm that's how I'm trying to get on with it. Yeah. Okay, okay. So what's your ultimate goal in music? Like what's one thing you wanna accomplish? Um the main thing I just wanna accomplish right now is getting on and probably getting better, like making it like making my music elevate more. And people really understand my story, get the message. Cause every song I do is a, it's a message, it's a story. Okay. And I just want to get the guys on and let y'all hear all the other talent that's from my hood. So, wow. Okay. So what to expect next? You got your EP out already? Yeah, I just dropped The Chosen Astronaut on May yeah. 4th. Um, what's next for me? Yeah, what's next? Uh, I'm going to do... Probably the guys tape is next. Well, EJ dropping his shit, but for me, the guys tape is next. And then I'm going to drop again probably like October. Um, Nightmare on D-Block Part 2. Okay. Yeah. That's a vibe. Right now, I'm trying to get the videos out. Right? All right, so more visuals. Yeah, more EP, visuals. EP. In the fall type. Wow. <laughs> so tell the people where to find you and the find music. All right, so Instagram. At Howie, H O W I E E, zero zero underscore. Um, YouTube, Howie, H O W, capital O, capital O.